we'll come to tutorial number five about how to add the dimensions we already knew how to draw some simple sketches by the line rectangle slot circle and arc and now it's time to add some dimension so let's start with some sketch choose the plane and here we choose the sketch so that we enter the sketch mode so let's choose a rectangle and here we can choose the origin line means 0x, 0y, 0z and now to add a dimension first we press ok smart dimension and just press on that line and again so we will see this display here so we can add the dimension we want so let's add 50 millimeters and here we can regenerate the the shape we can see it here and here we cancel and again to edit the dimension double click on it and write 50 and we finish we just press ok and again we can apply dimension on the other part of the rectangle and this time I write 80 millimeters and then ok and in the dimension we can edit the dimension the way how it looks for example after adding the value of the dimension we can change its properties depending on the way of drawing for example we have here the tolerances we can choose which type of tolerances you use for example limit and here we have a tolerance of 2 millimeters and we can add the minus tolerance to be 1 millimeter so that depending on the design you are doing also we can change to symmetrical as you see here this type of tolerance and minimum max so that depending on the type of the design and here we can write some thing on the line instead of the dimension for example we can add special sample yes so we have this sample for example we can write again 8 millimeters and then and again we can change the text here line 1 and so on so let's back with the the value of this dimension and here we have the leader we can change the way how to display the arrows for example we can make it from outside or from inside depending on the way of drawing and here we can change the shape of the arrow so I'm going to choose the default arrow so now I can close this tutorial about the dimension I can also apply the dimension as well on any other type of shapes for example the circle small dimension 
click and then change ok so it is a simple way for applying the dimension so see you in the next tutorial